A non-uniform rod 1.2 meters long rests horizontally on smooth pegs A and B at each end of the rod. The contact forces at A and B are 12 newtons and 18 newtons respectively as shown in the diagram. So here we have a rod, a peg here and a peg here, there'll be a contact force here, 12 newtons going up and a contact force here of 18 newtons going up. The rod is 1.2 meters long. Calculate the distance of the center of mass of the rod from A. So the rod is non-uniform. So a little diagram will help. So that the rod is non-uniform, so that we can't say the center of the mass will be halfway along the rod. So what we need to say is that the center of mass is X uh, meters away from A, and the weight of the rod will be mass times gravity. Right, if we now resolve vertically this way, then we've got 12 plus 18 going upwards and then going downwards we've got mg, that will give the mg is equal to 30 newtons. So we've got a 30 newton force acting downwards at some distance from A. And what we need to do is find that distance. So we're going to let that distance be x. And then if we take moments about A, the anticlockwise ones are positive, so that's going to be 18 times 1.2. And then going in the uh, clockwise direction, we're going to have the 30 newtons times x minus is equal to zero. Um, solving that, we're going to have 21.6 minus 30x is equal to zero. Therefore, 30x is 21.6. Therefore, x will be 0 0.72 meters away from a. So there's been a video to show you how to find the distance of a centre of mass from a particular point of a non-uniform rod. I hope you've understood and I thank you very much for watching.